I'm Raynard Churchwell, and you're watching College Park TV 23 News. And we want to begin with a back to school update. As Fulton County and Clayton County schools opened their doors for the second week of August, Fulton County greeted nearly 90,000 students on its first day, making it the fourth largest school district in Georgia. Clayton County, the fifth largest school system, has over 50,000 students. And in order to get those young people ready for school, College Park Water representatives held their annual backpack celebrations from July 27th through August 2nd. Each of the four councilmen held their celebrations in their respective wards. When asked about the impact these backpacks make, Ward 1 Councilman Ambrose Clay offered the following. The kids enjoy the pool, it gets them excited about going back to school, and they, they get the supplies they need. But the other part of it is that it's a real community event. We all come together as neighbors to make this event happen so that our students are ready to learn and thrive educationally. Best of luck to all students for the 2018-2019 school year and many thanks to the councilmen and volunteers for their efforts. College Park is building a multi-purpose arena at the western end of the Georgia International Convention Center. The arena at the Gateway Center will certainly be a welcome addition to the city's entertainment landscape. Here's more. Three. The arena at the Gateway Center, College Park's newest undertaking now under construction next to the Georgia International Convention Center. After months of negotiations, meetings, and a February groundbreaking ceremony, work began in earnest with tree removal along the perimeter of the sites. There's 56 trees that are being cut down today and the use of them, they're going to uh, grind them up and mulch and be able to use them around flower beds uh, at a later time. Prior to digging, engineers were on site to locate any pre-existing utilities or cables. The arena construction will be lower than the existing topography, so dirt has to be excavated. What you see behind me is early arena construction in College Park, where nearly 400 trucks of dirt are moving per day. Now that dirt will be used in another location here in College Park. The multi-purpose arena will become a sports and entertainment venue with the Atlanta Hawks G League team confirmed as its main tenant. The arena is designed to hold 3,500 seats for basketball and up to 5,000 seats for concerts. The construction is expected to be completed in the fall of 2019 where it will enhance and adorn the Gateway Center. Other construction underway includes the BMW Technology Center, a second Class A office building, a new hotel along Roosevelt Highway, and an airport parking deck. Construction is scheduled to be completed in October of 2019. One can imagine with the connectivity of MARTA and the ATL SkyTrain, this venue will become a major player in the metropolitan Atlanta entertainment market. College Park Water, Sewer, and Streets Division workers recently performed some heavy machinery work near an apartment complex on Cambridge Avenue. The assignment required digging to provide separate meters for each apartment unit. The Public Works Group also performed maintenance and tie-ins at the Bill Badgett Stadium on College Street. True professionals making good things happen in College Park. With Police Chief Keith Meadows' departure to the city of South Fulton, College Park has named Deputy Chief Furman Williford as the new interim police chief. Williford is a veteran and proven leader of the College Park Police Force, as well as a long-standing resident of this great city. We wish the interim chief the best. And another great day in College Park, with an open house for the new fire station number three on West Fayetteville Road. Chief Elmore and his team, always serving the public at the highest level, rode out a new fire truck delivered in late July. Prepare yourself for an unparalleled golfing experience at the historic College Park Golf Course. The nine-hole course is a pleasure for golfers of any skill level. It offers major challenges while providing a relaxing, picturesque backdrop. Test your accuracy with the fairways, water hazards, and sand traps. It has everything necessary to improve your game. Exceptional service with a comfortable atmosphere located just along Camp Creek Parkway. This course is open every day from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. For more information, go to cph9golf.com. And that's all for now. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to follow us on social media to stay abreast on the great things happening in College Park. I'm Raynard Churchwell. Make it a great day.